It is so exciting because I'm actually standing in Jonelle's Price's Lorry. Now Jonelle won Babington last year and this year I'm cooking with her. This is very exciting. <laughs> this is very exciting. Now listen, tell me, do you love cooking? I do. Okay, yeah. so what did you say when you heard I wanted to cook with you today? I was a little uh, scared. I've seen you on the TV a few times. You see, my reputation has gone beyond. Yeah. But first of all, it was a massive task, wasn't it, to actually cook to win last year. It was a massive feat to yeah. actually get all the trials and get it all done. And were yeah. you surprised or I you were I determined was really to go shocked. for it? You yeah. were shocked. No, I was. I mean, it's it's a lifelong dream to win it somewhere yeah. like uh, Badminton or Trials. So, it's um, like Wimbledon, I suppose. It, it is. It yes. is the holy grail of eventing. Yes. So uh, it's very special, something I'll remember forever. Yes. And um, yeah, it's, it's just a magical place. Now, yeah. what I'm going to be doing with you, I'm going to be doing um, harissa chicken with Caladini beans. I'm not cooking it, you are. We're also going to be doing some a rhubarb crumble. Now, rhubarb is in now, and with lovely grey bone, actually, apples, which, which will cook really, they cook well. And with a lovely oat crumble on the top, which we do in the oven. What you're going to do, this is a rub of spices. Okay, just an ordinary cumin, a bit of cumin, a bit of chilli. I would like you to take this chicken and you're going to sear it on each side. What we want to do is to just cook it enough so it's, the water will stop becoming liquidy, braising, and you'll brown it on each side. But do do we have to take into account the tracks on a bit of a lean and the oil goes down one way? Uh, you might have to, yeah, slightly. You're yeah. not used to Good track question. cooking, are you? I'm not used to track cooking! <laughs> you just touched the pan! <laughs> well, I, no, no, but I give you that one. I give you that. So I'm just slightly leaning it up, but yeah. I'm not moving it. <laughs> I'm not moving it! I promise you that one! I've got a pretty good uh, success all right, rate. All right, I'll give you that. I'll give you that. Onion stum, which is which is quite good. Okay. So what I'm going to do is the chicken okay? Yeah, chicken's fine. We're going to turn it over in a minute, but not quite yet. Oh yes, looking good. Looking good. That's oh, better. Yeah. That one's a good one. Yeah, they're not too brown on the other side, but they're not too bad. Do you like figs? Yeah, I do. Love yeah, them. Let's have some more then. Okay. I'd like you to put that chicken stock in there, please. Right, can you turn that off, please? Sure can. Right, what we're going to do, we're going to bring this into the oil and simmer it for about eight minutes, no more. Okay. All right, that's it, full stop, finished. So I want to put half that, half that serissa. Okay. Is so that half the quantity or the whole quantity? Okay. So about half? half? Quantity, you can keep the rest. Right, now that's going to cook for about um, 15 to 20, 15 minutes, 15 to 20 minutes, they're quite big. Okay, that's reduced down. You can see we've left the pig's hole there, yep. but that's okay. Now what you're going to do is put these kalalini beans in. That's okay. Now we need to cook that, mix it up, and we need to cook that for about 15 to 20 minutes again. This crumble mix is the mix. Now this is done with oats, Sugar, literally, bunged all together, and some butter. Yep. I'd like you to put it on here. Okay. Yes. We're going to toast it, are we? Yep, we're going to toast it. Now, this is wonderful in ice cream. This is absolutely... It will make Tim very happy. Oh, if you just do this. And do you know what? <laughs> this is also lovely in salads as well. Yep. All those sort of things. Salads, okay. ice cream. It's such a useful thing to do. Now, what's going to happen is you are now going to put that in the oven. I want you to peel the apples. We need to make a caramel and then we need to dilute it by make it watery by adding the fruit where the water will come out of it. Okay. Now you've noticed I haven't put too much sugar in the fruit. All right, very yep. little in that. Okay. The reason why you don't need it is because the sugar is more in the crumble part. Yep. Okay? Because sugar's not good for you, too much. Not no. Good for you. So, that's ready to go. Right, right, we're just keeping the yolks? Yes, just keeping the yolks. And um, so the whites, the whites, I'm afraid. Well, do you know, the horses would love it. Wouldn't the horse love it? 
cup for now and, you know, maybe we can make a meringue later. Yes, if you've got time. Yeah. <laughs> what I'd like to do is put this in, the rhubarb. So keep going. Oh, it's getting thicker now. Can <laughs> uh, you see? Yep. It's really thickened up. Carefully, take the crumble. Yep. Bit by bit. And put it all over the top, like that. Okay. So, now this is the rice. There. So what we're going to do, yep. here, is just Bring it up. Oh, actually, you should be doing this. Bring it up. I'm going to put a tiny bit of butter through it. Just to give it a little bit of richness. I wouldn't normally, but because we put no flavour in it, yeah. I'm going to season it with salt. I've got some salt. Yes. Make it look pretty. Now. What do you think? <laughs> It's a banquet. It's a banquet. <laughs> You're all welcome, by the way. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. Don't tell too don't many tell people. Don't tell too many people. I'm going to get a little bit of that as well. Mmm, really good. That would be so cool. But do you know what? No, seriously, it's been lovely. Seriously. Thank and you very much. Well, thank no, you. it's been fantastic Th for me. Well, is... thank you for having me mm. in your amazing lorry. I must say, I am. Um, absolutely overwhelmed by <laughs> also it's warmth and you know it all happens here it's amazing uh, i think it's wonderful <laughs> how lucky am i to have experienced it but yeah. thank you very much and also you have a lovely dinner tonight with your friend 